Greetings once again and uh, welcome to another episode of um, Organ Improvisation by Baba Jidi Odede Jaloduro. Yeah, today's episode uh, is basically on the fifth cycle and what I want us to look into is transpositions. It's very interesting in improvisation that you may want to play from one key and move to the other key. You want to enjoy the beauty of transposition. Then you need to understand the fifth cycle. Um, today, I will have to do quite a number of examples. Usually, from all examples we have been using over time, series of hymns have been played and uh, we have tried to you know adds one or two things to the music improvise it but today let us talk about how you can make a good transposition from the original key of a music to another key and back to the original key now here is where the fifth circle is very very important for example you have a c a hymn on c just like um if you will have okay you want to transpose it's much easier you go from no sharp no flats and you want to go to uh, one sharp key it's much easier or probably you want to play the minor of the C, which is A. Okay, from C to G, quite in, quite very simple. But let's imagine this. Um, I will want to say uh, a three, or let's say a semitone or um, a three tone interval. when I'm doing that but of course we have to take it because it's a class let's take it again let's see to G you have just one sharp in between so that makes a simple transposition um, from C to F major because on the fifth cycle when you have C you have R when you have C you have G Right, you need to understand the fifth cycle. You can, you will find a drawing of it in this video that I will be sharing. That is to F sharp. Oh, excuse me, sorry. That is to F major. Going from C to F major, even if you want to go from F, from C to F sharp, it's not a big deal. Yeah, that is where you need to understand basic harmonies. Um, it is much easier to transpose from the sharps to the sharps than the flats to the flat. I call something complex transposition where you want to move from flat to sharp. That is complex transposition. For example, let's take, let's say we start from G. One sharp.
position from sharp to flat. You need to go through the major and the minor, then you resolve back to the major of the sharp. It's a little bit complicated. I'm trying hard to find an easier way to do this explanation today because it's more uh, uh, handy to me for, for the flat. <laughs> and you want to explore it. Let's try. Sing Jatru. circle of fifth within this song and I want to keep my harmony. two flat to three flat to four flat back to one flat now let me mix it by going from flats to sharps You just need to know the relative minor of your major. You just need to know that. Um, like I said, I'm sharing the circle of fifths um, within the um, within the video, so we will keep at it and uh, move on it like that. Yes, here we come to the end of today's episode. That's a fifth cycle. I've cited quite a number of examples, and um, it really, really worth working on fifth cycle. And we close by saying and singing.
for listening and see you at the next episode.